Greetings everyone, I am RSV. This one point really kills the Medion is the Guardian theory. Let's discuss. As we know, the Guardian was the class lead of the Luster class. The Luster class's weapon was the Gunblade, and the Gunblade was featured as the Guardian's main weapon for the longest period of time. Sure, the Guardian used different weapons from time to time, but the Gunblade ended up ultimately canonically being the Guardian's main weapon of choice. Now this might seem like a random curveball. Well, it's actually a very important point to make before I go and talk about this topic. Why? I've discussed it before, but memory loss tends to not take away a person's skills or affinities with certain types of objects or tools. Memory loss specifically seems to more so target people's recollection of actually doing, not necessarily the skills associated with tools that they have used before. For example, someone with memory loss can still speak their native language. While they might forget certain words, they should still be able to get back up to fluency fairly quickly. And well, this would apply to stuff like swordsmanship and weapon preference as well. If you practice with something for a very long time, even made your own class out of it in the case of the Guardian, you'd expect even after memory loss for the character to have an affinity or connection with a weapon type. And well, that's the thing about the Gunblade. You can't really make the argument that it isn't in the game. Well, sorta. There are multiple times in the story where a connection to a Gunblade could have been developed. The first one is literally every single fight scene. Why do I say this? Multi-weaponing is a thing. While it wouldn't be an official Gunblade, it may as well be from the perspective of the characters in the world. A rifle mixed with a sword and the meteor on using that weapon would be a connection to the Guardian who used the Gunblade. But because there is no hint that the main characters multi-weaponed a sword with a rifle, or even Serene Blades with TMGs for that matter, this is a good arguing point that the Meteor and Guardian are not the same person. Because again, memory loss does not usually affect people's skills. And this is actually displayed by the Meteor if the Meteor and the Guardian are the same person. In a fairly short amount of time, the Meteor gets very skilled, in fact, outclasses many of the Arx defenders that are on Alpha at the time, which is a feat that suggests that the Meteor is remembering skills that they had before they lost their memory. So why not any connection to a Gunblade? Well, there is one other situation where there could have been a connection to a Gunblade, and that is the first enemy in Retum that uses a gun Gunblade. There could have been some mention of it or connection to it from the Meteor in the storyline, but there was not. Even something in jest as that gives me an idea or any comment on the weapon itself would be a hint that the Guardian and Meteor are the same character. Having some weapon consistency would be a major giveaway in the opinion. I personally find it easier to believe that the Meteor and Guardian aren't the same person rather than the Guardian completely lost all their memories, even down to skills that they have built into themselves for a long period of time. As I pointed out, the class does not need to be in the game for them to give this hint, and I do personally think that that does really make it hard to believe that the Meteor and Guardian are the same person. Is it too late to go back and fix that? Maybe? Maybe not. I personally think that it kind of is though. I think the damage in that regard has been done. Though I also question if it's an obvious hint that Sega is dropping that these characters are not the same. But I've been RSV. Do you think the Guardian and the Meteor are the same person? Let me know in the comments below. There is actually quite a bit differentiating the Meteor and the Guardian. Before I go though, I'll let you know that I actually set up a Discord channel finally. It's still heavy work in progress, though it should be accessible and people can suggest changes that needed to be added to it, as well as any emotes that they want added to the server. Link down in the description. But I've been RSV and I'll see you next time.